Hey guys, what's up, Gemini? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind too, that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So feel that I need to. Also remember, it's a general reading, so just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that's below as well. I don't know why my table is wobbly. Um, be careful what you wish for. That's what uh, the message was that came across when I was shuffling. All right, media future for the gems. Because you might just get it. You got the two of wands. So you're moving towards something. It's at the beginning stages, though. Oh, the Empress, Taurus, Libra, Energy. So you're doing your damn thing. You definitely are in your old, in your power. We have the Seven of Swords and the Strength card. The Seven is a Leo Aquarius energy. The Seven of Swords is a sneaky ass energy. So you may have like a situation that you already don't trust or, um, so it's gonna, I don't know, we'll have to see how it's going. Because with the Two of Wands here, you're moving towards something, but it's also like a choice card. Like taking off down one path and leaving like another one there. Show me that Two of, okay, thanks. The King of Wands. Oh, this dude. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Energy. Don't get caught up on the genders. It's just the masculine, and then you have very much a feminine energy here with the Empress. But that King of Wands, that can be a married man. That can be, yeah, this is a wish coming, you know. Somebody who's hopeful to move forward definitely could be an Aquarius with the star card here. This may have taken a while, but it's like somebody's trying to make something right. Somebody's trying to justify something because somebody has, like, suffered some type of loss or feel lonely. But this could also be somebody who, like, cheated you before or ghosted you before. Um, so... Anyways, the King of Wands energy, they can be a merry man. It doesn't have to be, though. A lot of times with the King of Wands, it's, like, really fun. It's really exciting as somebody who, like, says the right thing, does the right thing. But then, like, something always freaking happens. Yet it's something that, you know, we kind of hold on to and wish for. But somebody's realized, that, oh, something's going to get revealed because somebody is really nervous. Like, they're coming forward because they're nervous. Also, somebody could have car trouble. So, all right, show me the Empress. The Five of Cups. See, yeah, this, I mean, this is pretty straight towards it. Um, it depends how it's going, right? Because this person does care about you seeing you as the Empress. But with the Five of Cups, this person, it's like, um, that's, that's a card of regret. That's a card of let down, disappointment. The Six of Cups. I mean, this person's trying to come back. You have some communication coming in the five and the six of cups it's like hoping that you're going to take them back but then we're ending with that freaking seven of swords the magician the wheel yeah i mean the ball is in your court though with the empress there like this person's trying to come back there could have been like a situation where children are involved it doesn't have to be though, but they're trying to make something happen with you. They're still hoping that whoever this is, that they can come back around and make things right. You do have the Magician and the Seven of Swords. So, the Seven of Swords is sneaky. The Magician has tricks up their sleeves. The Magician never reveals their secrets. His secrets, her secrets, whatever. You know, don't get into gender. Show me this outcome for Gemini, please. So, the Strength and the Seven of Swords. With that Knight of Swords. So you definitely could be dealing with the air sign. I don't know if there's a reason. Why the Seven of Swords? Because with the Knight of Swords, you have communication coming in. Somebody very much determined to go towards it. Like kind of taken off there. But the Seven, that can kind of be... Um, tell me more about the Seven of Swords. The Two of Pentacles. See, we're still at the place. Remember at the beginning, we had the Two of Wands, right? Which is still a choice. So it's like somebody's going towards something, making things happen. They really do love you. They're hoping you're going to take a back, grow, expand, that type of thing. But we're still at this 
two of pentacles, two of wands. So, and, but you know, it's just an immediate future. But if this is something that kind of just keeps you in the same loop, or maybe somebody is juggling or just kind of like uh, wishy washy as hell, it's kind of the same thing. They definitely do see you as somebody who's very like beautiful, long term, wifey. Give me one more for the outcome. The devil. This is just going to take you right back in the same type of loop. And I think you already, with this Queen of Swords here, you probably already know that. The devil is Capricorn energy. But sometimes with the Two of Wands and the devil, if we keep picking the same path, it brings us back. Like, um, it's something that just kind of keeps us at this Two of Pentacles. It keeps us kind of, you know, like, it's the devil, right? So whether it's a person, an ex alcohol whatever it is it always loops you back to the same thing the fact that you're the devil and the magician the seven of swords we're starting the same way that we ended seven of swords and the devil together so this is somebody who's very attached to you uh could have a really high sex drive as well or like very physical all right, Gemini, I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is below as well. You guys take care, and I'll see you next time. Bye.